What is going on guys, it is Sambo here and welcome to another episode of Sam's Question. This is a series I'm bringing to you guys that involves me asking a question, I answer it myself in the commentary and then I'll only see your comments below responding to the question. So without further ado, let's get into it. But actually just before I do get into it, I'd like to apologise for not uploading that much. As some of you are aware, I've been doing my exams at the moment and my last one's this Friday so wish me the best of luck for that and to all of you that are still taking your exams um, I wish you all the best of luck I hope you all get what you deserve and yes good luck guys so the question in today's episode is should you see your childhood heroes meet your childhood heroes or fulfill your childhood dream because there's a saying, if some of you aren't aware, it's, you know, you should never meet your heroes because you don't know what they are actually like. Because, you know, they may be represented as something else when you see them on the TV or listen to them in your headphones. But when you actually see them, they could be, you know, they could be dicks or they could be, you know, they can be anything. So, on Friday I went to go see Blink-182 and when I was little I used to be in a band, um... I'm not going to tell you the names because you could go away and find it and oh god it'll be very embarrassing but um, we used to play like we made our own songs and stuff this is like when we was in year 6 to year 9 or something like that so we were together for quite a while and we started making songs and we made we covered a lot of songs and they were mostly Blink-182 songs because we're a three man band for most of the time anyway and it, that's the kind of reason why I always liked Blink when I was little in the year you know when I was in my last school I always used to listen to Blink I always brought, I was brought up that kind of music and I always wanted to see them and then for those of you that didn't know I think they split up in about 2004 or something like that after they made The Feeling this album and it was like oh I'm never going to have the chance to see my to see the band I've always wanted to see because I was so little it didn't really like occurred to me that I was going to go see, I just thought I'd see them when I grow up, and they split up, so I was really disappointed at the time, but a couple of years back, they they regrouped, and they started touring again, so we brought tickets, um, their tour got delayed by a year, so it was quite a anticipated wait, and then last Friday, we finally got to go see them, and it was the best fucking night ever, it was the best gig I'll probably go to in a very long time, and you know, I lost my phone, I crowd surfed, I was very ill when I got off the train, it was all the things that you would expect from having one of the best nights of your life and I know you may be like, well that's not the best things but trust me, it is once you grow up and you realise that, you know, without sounding like a dick, you only live once, then um, you got to make the most of everything and I definitely made the most of that night and went all out and had a good time, so my answer to Senior Childhood Heroes is like, you should because if you see them and they're what you expected and they're good then it's like you've, you've done something, you've fulfilled something that you've always wanted to do and it gives you a good feeling and then you get you can look for something else to aim for what, what's your next thing you want to do, what's your next aspiration, what do you want to go fulfill like for, for me in two weeks time I'm going Magaluf which obviously I'm going to be inactive for another week but that's something to talk about another time but that's an, that's my next step I'm gonna go Magaluf and with my mate and we're gonna get wow it's gonna be such an amazing week I'm gonna have so many stories to tell you guys on that and then I'm probably gonna have the best summer holidays of my life probably ever you know before I go away and do my, more work and stuff so I've got a lot to look forward to my question to you guys is you know who are your childhood heroes for a start and have you seen them? Do you want to see them? And you know, what what would you do if they weren't what you think they were going to be? Would you would you be really disappointed? Would you oh, shrug it off? And have you got another childhood hero set aside or childhood dream to do? So that's all for today's um, commentary, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And like I said, my exams on Friday. So once that's done and out of the way, I'll be bringing you more and more content. I've got a dual episode coming out soon with Tempo from Team Pure. He is a top lad. I've seen some of the edit already. It is very, very good. You've got a lot to look forward to right there. So that should be coming out pretty soon. Until then, guys, I'm Samuel Bo, and I'll speak to you all soon.